what you will need for this DIY is some suede leather cord, a small sphere locket that you can get from Michaels, some scissors, and some brown paint. You'll also need some small fine detail brushes. You'll start off by sketching the map on the sphere locket. To do that, I used some fine tipped micron pens. I used 005 and 003 micron pens. You can barely see the tip on the pen because it's so tiny but it works well for what we're trying to do. On the inside, you'll need some gesso, or you can just use white paint for the first layer. You'll also need black paint, and some light green and yellow paint, along with a brush and some parchment paper. First, you wanna take your gesso or your white paint now you're going to take your gesso or white paint and then coat the inside of the sphere locket. That way, when you're painting it black, you won't get streaks showing the gold metal behind it. And then leave it to dry. Once the gesso is dried, which usually doesn't take that long, you take the black paint and then paint over it, completely covering the white. Then you're going to take a bit of yellow and a bit of green paint and mix it together. Then you're going to take the small detail brush and paint little dots, ranging from small to smaller to extremely small on the inside. These will be like the stars and the planets inside of the map. See? Now going back to what we sketched before, we're going to take the brown paint and a detailed brush and paint over all the lines that we drew. It's best you take your time with this, as it can be a little tedious. Keep going, and then when you're done, you should have something like this. Next, take some glow paint, and you're going to apply that on the outside and on the inside of your sphere locket. First, you're going to use the detail brush and dot on the little green stars and planets that you did on the inside. Then, on the outside, you're going to take the glow paint and line out all the brown that you did before. You can also add the glow paint along the edges of the locket as well. Then you can leave your pendant in the sunlight to charge, and then it'll glow. Then you add your suede cord through the jump ring. And then you're done. You have a Treasure Planet pendant necklace. So I hope you enjoyed this DIY. I know a lot of people don't really care about this movie, but I do and I've always loved the treasure map so much and I wanted to make my own. So hopefully you guys can make one too. Bye.